Breaking ground and breaking barriers. That's the goal for the Native American Youth and Family Center nonprofit as they set to build new affordable housing in North Portland. And they blessed the grounds today to shine a light on the culture and the crucial need behind this project. Fox Falls Carly Olson was there and has the story. Yahweh, hi, Yahweh. A song of celebration. Three, two, one. For a day 15 years in the making. This is a, an important property for the Native community. The Native American Youth and Family Center bought a 34 unit affordable housing complex in 2007 on this North Portland street. The units were outdated and hard to maintain, but on Wednesday, <laughs> that all changes. We're just excited to bring 58 affordable units to this great neighborhood uh, in partnership with NEA. The nonprofit raised $37 million to rebuild the property known as Tislaw Village. A rebuild is necessary and um, the residents are, are just going to love it. About half the residents are actually going to come back and move into the new property. Two service providers from the Native American Rehabilitation Association will live on site to support the residents. Though it's open to everyone, the site will be geared toward Native families. Well, the Native community is disproportionately affected by the homeless crisis and also uh, lack good paying jobs and, and need affordable housing more than any other group here in the Portland area. So having affordable housing development for them and by the Native community is so important. Data from the latest point in time count shows a 25% increase in Multnomah County's indigenous homeless population between 2019 and 2022. It's a number the nonprofit hopes to help bring down. It's important for the community to have a place to call home. They expect to complete the project in fall of 2024. Carly Olson, Fox 12 Oregon.